Hello! Right, we've gone live. Okay, this, by the way, this is going to be rerun. Not a rerun to rerun or something. Anyway, this is my first actual Twitch live stream thing, whatever. Because I've, like, not done this ever. So, today, as you can see, we're playing another brick in a mole. Uh, start a new game. So far on my computer it says that. There's no viewers at the moment, but this will be rerun, so. Let's go start with normal without a tutorial. A tutorial. Uh, I've got some mods on. Do you know what? Let's not have any mods on. I've played this game before, by the way. Just want to let you know that. Oh, but... This person is quite good, but I don't want the multi-level, uh, no, new, oh, this one is good though, the walls, because there isn't any glass walls in the game, this one's good as well, that one, uh, what are you, oh, this one's really good, because it's better than the normal things, do you know what, no, nah, let's leave it off for this stream, Anyway, this stream's probably going to go on for about half an hour, because it's my first one. So I'm just going to go and set a timer for half an hour. There we go. Half an hour time has started. So, we've got three mods on. Starting with that tutorial. Uh, do you want to start with a tutorial, just for your sake? All right. Here we are. Hello and welcome. You have somehow inherited this massive piece of land. Regional planning, however, forbids residential or industrial zoning in the area. Commercial is your only option. Alright. WSD for pan the camera and then T and G for zoom. Okay. So I'll open the first business. Let's get started. Right. Foundation. Build foundation there it's literally just a game there you go let's be the time can i like click on anything else no okay all right so Currently, we still got no viewers, but it's going to be rerun, so hopefully I'll get a tiny bit. So, anyway, if you do like this, please, I don't know, follow or something. I don't know what you do on Twitch, but, yeah. Oh, right, that's done. Let's build, when you build doors, I sent that. Click build, then click objects, move staff door and a double door. Right. Double door, go there. Staff door, go there. And to play, separate our future storage and our store with a wall. Let's build a mode with a selected walls. There's wall, build wall there. Let's put the a staff door on this wall as well. And sign, we make this an actual storage zone and make this a store zone. And then we need to get some shelving. So food shelving there, 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 there. And then it's a shelf there, there, there. So these are generic food shelves. They hold, well, I don't know, food. <laughs> then these shelves hold like normal things that isn't food, pretty much. Uh, right, let's get a checkout counter. Let's go there, there, and there. Right, you need to set that, select on the select mode, and then right click on the shells, it probably looks good, and then that. Okay, what's this? Builders can't access work orders for us because they just built the door. Okay, let's go. Right, they've built all that. Right click, let's go with candies, because that's what you have mainly when you walk into a normal store, isn't it? When you walk in, you have candies right in front of your face. Right, what goes well with candy? Snacks and cookies. Uh, sliced bread, have some... Uh, no, wait, let's get some breakfast 
cereal? Have I done that? Yeah. Right, and then get some coffee and tea. Because everyone likes a nice cuppa. At the back, let's just have some diapers, toilet paper, pads and tampons. Right, let's build a loading zone for delivery. So let's build roadwork and it's loading zone. Build it there. We need a link or storage and that's that to go to manage into your store into the list. Click on the zone tab and then the link things and manage the store link storage you. That's important. We need a manage mode. You need fair. You need select your store in the list and then click on the staff tab. Okay, staff. Uh, hire a cashier. Let's see. It's a good one. So these are the traits, and this is bar speed, patience, and sociability. Speed is determines the speed of walking of all characters. Also determines the customer's checkout time. But there's thing here the cashier skill determines the speed at which cashiers process checkouts okay so I suppose you does that the I suppose the speed overwrites that then because that's the process that's the hunt but the checkout time so let's go with you and we need a stock clerk as well so i think stock clerk speed of what's deliver stock and I suppose we need big that and that but also they're kind of the same thing let's just go with you right we've got bonus for opening a business <laughs> so let's get a trash can right there build a garbage pickup so that'll be in roadwork garbage pickup there right lastly we need to hire janitors to keep the floors clean and handle the garbage so I don't have too much to do that's the maintenance centre alright so it's in the maintenance centre janitor uh, let's get what's the skill on this one the janitor sounds the skill of which speed will clean alright so, I suppose we'll go with Henderson. Good, it's taken care of at the moment. It's a small fraction of that. Provides the office for new research. Okay. Build foundation there. And the boom, from it, it's, you know, finished. Okay. We need staff door there. So, we use staff door. Uh, office desk is that in here. Oh, office desk. There and there. Sign this as an office that we can sign the office. Ah, oh, there. There we go. Right. Office workers will work on research projects and marketing campaigns in manage mode. Select your office in the list. Click on the staff tab and hire two office workers. You office. I've seen done it in multiple hires. Right, we do spend which the staff will research. Oh, that's quite good. You've got the most, so we'll get you uh, 18, 22, and 20. We'll get you. There we go. All seems to seem to be in order. Let's smooth expansion, keep you busy the builders busy, your bottom will fill up very quickly, build some more accommodate visitors. The default store open hours are an ambitious and manage your stores earlier and close later. You also need to hire cashiers for white boots. Okay. Okay and okay. Right. That's tutorial finished. All right. She did say that we do need some more parking for everyone. So let's get some more park customer parking. There we are. Get some more of that. What's this thing? Floor tiles, right? These are quite good. I suppose we can get like a little path along the outside. So like that. I suppose that would look nice. 
Right. Do we actually need to like manage like things? How do we like change everything? So maintenance and uh, nothing. Storage. Desired load. Let's just change it to like eighty percent. Store. We've already linked it to that. Opening hours. We're currently at eight. Staff. Shift planning. All right. So these are like the shifts of everyone. Should be all right. So we open at nine, close at five. So nine to five. Shop. What are these? So new objectives: sell ten different types of products, turn daily profit over a hundred, and make a hundred total sales and get ten thousand from that. Suppose these are new businesses people want. Suppose that's what we're going to have once the mall properly opens up. Right. We open at nine, so we'll have to wait until then. But in the meantime, let's build this a bit bigger. Right, let's get a... Where's the shelving gun? The shelving gun go there and there. Yeah, that's perfect. store officially opens in about an hour so let's pause it let's assign this as a store oh yeah i do see about filling our bus just with our staff as well we might need like is there like staff parking staff only parking that's what we need let's get a road done here so we can make some more parking later get a staff only parking build it there Right, so sign this as a store, and so that as a store, let's build more shelving. Let's get a little bit more food shelving, because we need a bit more, and then a normal shelves. I suppose... If we can move them to there, so get them more to the back, so it'll be a bit better. But this one cashier, I don't think it's going to do it. Apparently we're having parking troubles, and we are. So let's get some more parking. So let's just expand this down here, and then we can get some more parking there. So let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's have that go down to there there we go but that one cashier isn't gonna manage so let's go store hire cashier do we have one that's good speed and that 25 23 and 28 they've also got good speed let's up you right Oh, got a first chat. I'm going to probably butcher this, by the way. So it is Bosch18. A, what's up, G? There you go. Right, let's move these normal shelvings. Let's move all these. And then move, is there like a hockey? Hockey M. Let's hit M. Move all them. Builders should do that. Oh, plus we need more parking as well. Customer parking. Here we go. Builders. Oh, we'll pause. Uh, builders should be able to build all these. We can put some more. Right, here we go. Let's move all these. I accidentally misclicked that. So, let's get rid of these. Yeah, we've got more caches, so that should be okay. So, let's move that one there, move that one there. And that's going to have sources and seasoning. 
rice and pasta and does pet food go next to rice and pasta? I suppose we'll go canned food, that'll be better. So let's go with what are there in here? We've got greeting cards, school supplies, backpacks and sports balls, construction toys, board games and action figures, car tools. Uh, light bulbs, electricity, bed sheets, cookware, and dishes. Let's go with let's go toys and games at the top here. Oh right, sell ten different types of products. We've got to reward the five thousand for that. I suppose we like government grants or something. It's probably what they are. Yeah. Right. The word of the mouth today is drugstore, video game store, and a non-retail business is fast food restaurants. Oh, we made 100 total sales. We get 10,000. So let's close you. Sell 20 types of that, get 10,000. So I'll have 100 customers on site. We're only getting, like, 13. Right. Have 100 customers on site. Make 500 total sales. What are these supposed to be doing? Is it... It was something to do with research. Alright. Oh, this is research. Get night hours, alcohol license, cold chain, sales monitoring, security, logistics, or logistics. Allows delivery of four crates at a time, so the two. Don't think we need that yet. Cleaning technology, automatic floor scrubbers for your janitors. Don't think we need that yet. Bowling. I suppose these are like the non-retail ones then. So yeah, bowling, cinema and fitness centres. Chemical supplier is mainly just health and health care mainly. Get clothing. Oh, we could get clothing, should we? Let's get... Cold chain first. So we should get like, I don't know, is there like fridges in here? So, yeah, fridge. They can hold soda, bottled water, beer, ice cream, milk, dairy, fresh meat, frozen vegetables, frozen pizzas, fresh fish and juices. Table. Fresh bread. Ooh. Let's get some of that. Where should we put it? Where should we put it? Let's put it like... Here, right at the very top of the store. So, fresh bread for that. Alright, so we're waiting till morning, but might as well build some more staff parking. So let's increase the road there and customer park and move that there as well. Right, staff only parking. There, 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 and there. Builders should get building it. Let's have a look. Whoa. So profit margin we get sixty seven percent. That's alright for like a tiny little nine to five shop and the checkout counters all be filling up quite a lot but it's all right at the moment so who are you you're the stock clerk and these are cashiers yes stock clerk oh traits neat freak stong stomach and a shoe collector neat freak can't resist detergents get nauseous twice as fast Bonus janitor skill. Okay. Strong stomach. Nausea is capped at 50 and we lost it. Can we like... Wait. Oh, manage door. Here we go. Staff. Sock clerk. Nausea is capped at 50 and shoe collector can't resist shoes. Who on earth could be a shoe collector? Alright, so we did actually have a full queue yesterday so let's get a, another checkout counter there and another cashier is there any good ones you're good but you're not good fast let's 
get you in case. So that, that should be okay. And even if we had another so we can get one there. Still got loads of money. What should we do with that? Hmm? Overall, can we like change the opening hours? Can we like... Oh, so you can have it like... What's the max you can have it? I think that was a research from night hours. What is this? Open business between midnight and 6 a.m. I suppose you can do up to 6 a.m. till midnight then. Let's go 6 a.m. till 6 p.m. And then we can mess around with the staff planning. So 6 a.m. until. When was it? It was. 6 p.m. Yeah, 6 p.m. So have you there? And then we've got this middle one here. Let's have it there. And then you can come in halfway through the day and stay there. So we should be able to cope with more customers throughout the whole day now. And it looks like we're getting better parking situations because all the staff are parking in here as well so yeah we are looking quite good for the moment originally it would have closed now but we are keeping our doors open How much is that? Is that one, two, three? So we could actually get three things there. Let's do that. While it's out of hour, let's do that. And then we can get more shelving there. So let's get some more shelving. There, there, and there, 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 and there. This can be like... Oh, wait, we need to sign this as a store. So, what can these be? We've got six, so... Like, school supplies? Backpacks probably go well with that. Sports balls, there. Get some greeting cards, that'll be good. Car tools won't look good around there. Let's get some... Light bulbs and electricity and cookware. So it's all go together. Uh things should come in. Yep. Alright. Yeah, just to let everyone know that this is still my first stream, like, live stream ever in Twitch. I've never used it before. I, like, the whole of yesterday and this morning was just messing around on just the settings and everything. So, yeah. Suppose now we can just sit back and relax now, can't we? Oh, but those lines do not look good. And we just finished that research. So we've got milk, dairy, fresh meat, fresh fish, and fresh fruits, and fresh vegetables. We could get ice cream, frozen vegetables, frozen pizzas. But let's go and get all these down there. Bus transport allows to construct up to 10 bus stops. Underground parking would be good. Road network. So the... What's road network for? I think they're... Because... Yeah, these, these little bits here. They've got another entrances. 
So you have to research road networks to unlock the entrance. Okay. Anyway, we have to sort this store out anyway. Let's just get another cashier. Would that be good? Oh, your good speed. What's patience for? Determines the pa patience determines at which rate customer satisfaction decays while queuing. Oh, okay, so you're good patient, so they wouldn't get annoyed. Sociability. Sociability determines the ability for cashiers to cheer up customers at checkout. That's good, that is. And that customer's response to it. Example, if either sociability is close to zero, the churn will be null. Okay, so I think you'll be good. You haven't got a good cashier rating, but I think you'll be better. Anyway, so let's get you there. Plus, we need another cashier counter. Why is that then? You're not researching anything at the moment. I thought we were. Oh no, we looked at the road reef, the road research thing, weren't we? Uh, let's get alcohol license. Let's go. Let's continue with cold chain and get frozen food supply. So now we can like move, build more pairs so we can get one. Just move it one more up. I'll show you what I'm doing in a minute. But basically, we're going to have another shelf here. So it's back-to-back -back shelving. And then we get another back-to-back -back shelving here as well. Now that we haven't got any, like, checkout counters covering the space. All right, store. We need to sign this as the store. Sign and sign. And build... What is it? It's... This isn't it. No, it's fridges. That's it. So, what? How many fridges do we need? We need milk. That's one. Dairy, meat, fish, fruits, vegetables. That's six. And then ice cream, frozen vegetables, frozen peach. So that's nine. So we need nine fridges. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine. Let's move, remove them and put these all up here. Right. New business people want grocery store, women's shoe shop, and a fast food restaurant. Don't really care about them. Right. Let's assign these milk, dairy. Let's. Have the f meat up here, fresh meat and fish. And then we've got the other frozen food supplier, which covers the extra three. Wait, what? Three? Why have I got milk, dairy, yeah, meat, that, uh, fresh fruits and vegetables? Do we have them? No. Why don't we have them? Do these go on, like, tables or something? Oh, they go on tables. All right. Oh, so that gives me an idea. Let's remove them. And then move these up there. Move the tables up there so we get the fresh things next to it as well. So we get the meat, fish, and how many things do we have in there? Three, so we need one more fridge. Why are you destroying that? Let's build a wall there. I don't know why you just destroyed an extra piece of wall. Anyway, the half an hour that I chose to be streaming is nearly up. It's two minutes left, so. Yeah. It's, it's quite good for my first stream, though. I've got one viewer so far. That's live, by the way. So, yeah. Plus, I will be uploading this to my YouTube channel, Liam's Gaming, on YouTube as well. So, yeah.
hopefully I'll get a mention of something, I don't know. So we need one more of that, and then we need a table there, there, and there. Let's get all the fresh things there, but then we just cover this bit. Clothing, probably. Clothing probably go there. So, yeah. Right, so let's get fresh bread there. What are you? Customers are leaving because they're hungry and there are no restaurants or restaurants are full. Well, that's your fault, isn't it? Why don't you come here if we knew we had no restaurants and, like, you're getting confused and don't know what to do because there's no restaurants. Anyway, I will leave a thing in, on my YouTube channel linking it to this Twitch channel as well. All checkout things getting quite full, and there's no parking again. Right, let's do that, that, and that. Let's keep building back, but we can add one there, though. Oh, that's timer. Pause. I set a timer for half an hour because I didn't really want to be. Going over that. Oh, I just noticed our daily profits are 2,000. That's quite a lot. It's quite good, that is. Anyway, hopefully you did enjoy. And, yeah. Hopefully you did enjoy my first stream ever. Hopefully I'll be doing more of them. So, yeah. I, I don't know if you can, like, follow or anything. But, yeah, if you can, can you please do that? And, yeah, I will firstly save this under, I don't know, go Twitch mall. Although it's not a mall. That's not a small Twitch. It's T-W-I-H. T-W-I-T-H. Twitch mall. Why is it not adding spaces? And it doesn't care. Right. God. Save game. Twitch. I don't think you can add spaces. Okay. More. All right. Save game. <laughs> right. What are our profit margins? It's 81%. That's quite a lot. Anyway. I will see you all next time if I do another live stream thing over the summer holidays and things. But yeah, I will see you later and I'll add this onto my YouTube account thing as well. So I'll see you later. Goodbye.